of the things that we keep hearing from our alumni is that we are very unique in that the in attention we give to the students is very individualized because we're a small program. We have the opportunity to work very close to the students in individual basis. Every school is going to be right for somebody. The kind of place that we are is a, is a learning by doing model. If you like to roll up your sleeves and do the work, uh, be involved, that you learn best while being in a show or you learn best by working on the equipment that is actually being used for the show, that's us. Our um, studio classes are anywhere from 10 to 12 students up to 15 and the students really uh, receive a lot of individual attention from the faculty. We have a two tracks running kind of model where students are learning in the classroom and then immediately applying that to the work that they're doing in our fully functioning theater uh, offerings. You can major in English with a concentration in writing or journalism or literature. Currently we have uh, five majors, art, art therapy, graphic design, art and design teaching, and web design and development. We have a lot of students who double major, who minor in theater, or who just love theater but really are committed to doing their nursing thing or their business thing or whatever it is that they are, want to focus their career on. There's, there's a place for all those people here. We have a jazz ensemble, we have two orchestras, we have three choirs, we have the concert band, we have so there are a lot of opportunities here for students who maybe are not looking for a major or a minor, but they could still get fine arts scholarships just for participating in the ensembles. We're very excited to be working here in the stream. Uh, this is a fairly new facility that we had a big hand in designing. Uh, it truly is a state-of-the-art building. Um, it's one of, I can honestly say that it's one of the best facilities in the Waku college system. We have music education uh, graduates who have great positions. People use the English major in general, but the writing and journalism concentrations in particular to do all kinds of different things. We've got a ton of students that are out in the workplace doing wonderful things in theater. Uh, we've got a group of students who are in Chicago. We've had several people go to law school. Currently we have three uh, recent graduates of our writing program who are in MFA programs in creative writing. By the time our student, all of our students graduate, they have put together a resume, a statement of art and or design philosophy, and they've also put together a digital portfolio of their fine art and or design. Um, this, these are essential for all students when applying for positions out there and also uh, for graduate programs as well. We've got a group of students who are out in New York City. We have someone teaching choir also in Verona. In journalism, we've had students go to work for newspapers, magazines, Wisconsin State Journal. We've got a group of students out in LA. People use this degree in many different ways. Some go into advertising, some go into public relations. So we have great uh, placement of uh, students. We're supporting the arts wherever they're happening, and we're really excited about that. The founders of Edgewood College, the Cincinnati Dominicans, have always valued the fine arts and have always viewed it as being central to the human experience. And I feel that we are carrying on that philosophy uh, to this day. Mm -hmm.